You know what, from a mechanical point of view, this game is pretty wank. I have to say. I have to say that if I put this next to Call of Duty, any Call of Duty really, and then said which one's better mechanically, I'd probably point to COD because COD's mechanics are pretty good. It's just that the games are really shit. And everything apart from the mechanics is, you know, you point at stuff, you shoot, and the, point, the stuff you point at and shoot at, yeah, it dies. This, on the other hand, Christ. Petty niggles, they add up, and there's so many of them. I mean, Christ, let me just have a look at this bit around here. Let me just have a look at this. Okay, so that bit falls down, which isn't pretty obvious, because, you know, there's loads of things that can stop you from being able to see that. Then you jump up here, yeah, 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 you swing across, swing, swing, and then this falls down. And that bit next to it, it doesn't look like you can jump through there. I mean, it doesn't. I can't even deny that. It looks unjump throughable. Oh, yeah, jump down, why not? Why not jump under the ledge above you? Oh, no, it's too mainstream. Screw you, Connor, and your stupid rules. I swear he just tries to be a hipster. He just doesn't want to do things that everyone else does. Okay. Swing, swing. Come on, Charles. All I want to do is touch your beard, hug you, whisper into your ear, and then I'll be on my way. Oh, you plonker. Come on, that doesn't hurt too much. You're video game characters, you can take it. Oh, of course. It's just going to be like, hate them, isn't it? You persist. You put us down, wow. We rise again. You end one that lip syncing. <laughs> you try so hard, but it always ends the so. You know Sorry, but. You think you're mad. This is why Sorry, but this is crap. <laughs> this is crap. Even those men you sought to save have turned their backs on you. Yet you fight. You resist. Why? Because no one else will. Every fucking enemy in this game is shit. I <laughs> hate them. The man's had decades of experience and has toned his skills immensely. Let's an assassin use his fucking hidden blade arm. Obviously, I could even see from the camera angle, without even like seeing the zoomed in one, that he was taking a gun out. Why would you stand there making a speech? Just stab him in the face. Fucking. No wonder the feud never fucking ends. The assassins get by really fucking cheaply, like, you know, they'll have one per fucking century, or maybe two. You know, Achilles and Connor. You know, there's not many assassins around, but it's because all the fucking Templars, they're fucking shit. They're fucking lovely people, I love them to death, I love Charles, I love Haytham. They're immaculate gentlemen, and really, you know, deserved of, uh, of the lifestyles that they lead, but... Why are they so bad at, you know, finishing off their enemies? <laughs> Rough night, was it? He headed inland, the ferry of the Charles River. He's got his own river. I will need passage as well. Of course. Only say the word. I'm sorry. Am I playing Resident Evil? I could have sworn that we've killed him about five times now. Why do we keep letting him get away? Granted, we got impaled by a piece of wood. Don't know how the fuck that happened. But we shot him in the chest. Uh, we, uh, we had ample opportunity to kill him. I think, didn't he fall to a knee? We could have just leant over and pricked him in the nose with a blade. I mean, come on, Connor. You really don't seem too enthusiastic about killing this guy. You just want to keep letting him live. Okay. Where are we now? Is this some lovely new location or is this the frontier? This is the frontier, isn't it? Yep. Of course. 
Isn't this the house where I got a courier mission? Why am I so slow? Jesus Christ. Look, holding down the sprint button makes you go this slow. Letting go of it, you go faster. Christ, Connor, d go to sleep or something. Have some tea. I don't know, eat a pie. Stop trying to kill this rogue prick. Everyone else he's ever known is dead. He's probably got no power left. He's been shot. Leave it. Go back to Achilles. He's, Achilles is probably dead. You probably missed the funeral. Oh, now he's fine when he opens the door. It's just a tavern. Oh, God. We're going to fucking break the hand of another guy. Oh, no. Charles, do you want to play some Nine Men's Morris? Wow, we're like brothers. Oh, don't fucking swivel the chair around like you always fucking do. You always sit on it backwards, it's kind of annoying. Hey, you're basically my stepfather. You didn't like go to a doctor or anything with that wound, Charles? No, okay. We got a doctor, we could help you. It's poisoned. He killed himself so they kill you. So, we've both got massive holes in ourselves. See, why are we killing each other? We're fucking... Look at us. We love each other. Unsporting, Connor. To say the least. If it was any other game protagonist, he probably would have just, like, left the knife stuck in the table and then walked away. Because he realised, you know, he's just a human being and he's just got the same ambitions just the same as you, he's just on the other side of the fence. And you, and you just go and stab him in a tavern. And no one even is alarmed by that. I didn't hear the scream or the stab. Nothing, no, no. I understand. I really don't. I understand why we had to kill Charles Lee. I understand. He didn't do anything. He was done. He'd finished. They weren't getting past Washington anyway. We can rewrite history with the Animus, can't we? That's what it's for. Or at least we can rewrite, you know, the documented history. Not actual history, it's just what people thought happened. Oh shit, now we get to report back to our... I forgot what we were doing this for these people. It's our lovely, weird cricket ball. Oh yeah, where's the rest of our people? I thought they migrated somewhere, or died. So we're defending an empty village for a bunch of ghost people who got killed, you know, by some world ending event, the sun exploding. Long have we waited for you to return. You have done as we asked. You have succeeded. No, I have failed. My people are gone. Chased out by those who I thought would protect them. It is a trade, a sacrifice. And not in vain. For you have found it. This? Now you must hide it. Where none shall think to look. And then in time. In time. What once was. Shall be. Again. I do not understand. Nor need you. Only do as we ask, then you may do as you wish. But what of my people? You have saved this place, as was your people's purpose, and that matters most. It is not enough. It will never be enough. You strive for that which does not exist. Still, you have made a difference. And you will do so again. Remember, you must hide the amulet where none might find it. Let me guess, he's going to bury it with Achilles. I'm just going to put that out there. Oh, 
Oh shit, son. Oh no, the apple. Not like we have that in uh, real life or anything, and we killed a bunch of people at Ostogo for it. Now go bury that with Achilles, and well, we'll wrap the game up. You failed, Connor. Everyone you loved is dead. Even Achilles isn't around, or he won't be around for much longer if he, even if he is around. All the enemies that might have potentially loved you, like Hatham, he's dead. Every part of your people are gone. You have nothing to live for. No one in the homestead really likes you. I mean, you don't show any emotion to them. I mean, Chuck. Chuck? No, Norris. You know, Chuck Norris. No, be like, Norris, maybe. He likes you a little bit. It's just a bit... You just a bit fail, aren't you? Maybe the captain at the Aquila, but they don't really conversate. There's no like. So what are we doing? Are we digging a grave? <laughs> We're going to dig a hole for the thing. With the amulet. See, we could have just skipped to this bit. Really? I'm pretty sure. I don't know what. Oh, Achilles is dead then, isn't he? Poor Achilles. Um, uh, 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 um, what? Connor de- de- He only lived to be seven? Am I missing something here? <laughs> I'm missing something, aren't I? Look at that low res feather. So, what, Achilles had a son and he died at the age of seven? It's called Davenport. The place. Must be something to do with the heritage of this place. I'm pretty sure our real name's not Connor, and our last name's not Davenport, and we didn't die in 1755, and we're not actually dead. And we weren't seven. Uh, I'm pretty, I mean, come on. What am I missing here? Is this obvious or a secret that's just been revealed? And it's supposed to be shocking. Oh, the sum of truth. 50G. That's worth looking at, isn't it? So, P612. Well, not really. <laughs> yes, you play. Because I really fucking love you play, man. Awesome. Connor, what have you done? What have you done, man? Oh, now we get to play Adam Sandler for the last parts of his miserable life. Maybe? Dunno. So I didn't even need dialogue. The story is just they stopped trying, didn't they? This is just fucking crap. I know where the key is. Then let's go. Yeah, why not just go out to Boston or actually it's not even in Boston, is it? Here lies the body of what does that say? The old man something? Sorry, but Grave diggers. Oh wow! One extensive dialogue-driven cutscene. This is it. We're right behind you. Wait, 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 Desmond! If you die, how will I be 100% in this game afterwards? I guess the right epilogue missions, actually. So wait a minute. We put all those power cubes in to turn this barricade on in the first place, and now we're just going to use the sound to get rid of it? Come on, Sean. I love you, Sean. You're like the only other good character, because you're British. All the British people are dying. Fucking Ubisoft. I know that's pretty much what this time period was, a bunch of British people dying, but... If this just doesn't open, or something... That's like some alternate ending you get for, like, not getting full sync and other things, so the gate doesn't open. And the game just ends. Wait, how did you just rip that off without breaking it? I'm sorry, but the first civilization are fucking crackheads, aren't they? I mean, what the fuck are they doing making all this cryptic bullshit? What if no one invented the Animus? This shit would be fucked. Did they bank on that? Did they put bets around that happening? Look at the fucking eyes of my father. He's like, oh shit, son.